Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are watching this out there on the World Wide Web. This is Jeremy Gaynor for Syscon TV here at 13th Cloud Expo, Cloud Expo, Silicon Valley. I have with me Wayne Ariola, Chief Strategy Officer of Parastoff. Greetings, Wayne. Greetings, Jeremy. Uh, I wouldn't be too friendly because I have a rather tough question for you, sir. I know that you're now Chief Strategy Officer and therefore arbiter of all things cloudy, but I have a question for you in all seriousness. Parasoft can't possibly keep reinventing itself. Surely it's time to, you know, just pop your clogs and give it all up. Or, or, and this is the challenge, is there as yet an unused colloquy, an untilled field that you can till and make fertilize and grow the way you've done for God knows how so many poetic. years? So poetic. Is there a colloquy left? Mr. Ariola, yes or no? There absolutely is. And no, there's not. No. Before I start, let me just say, what a great product. Cloud Expo has just been phenomenal. Congratulations, by the way, as the 13th one. And I, I mean, us as not only Parasoft, but I think that the constituents that are here really enjoy themselves, number one, and two, just a great agenda. So congratulations on Well, we you. accept with grace on behalf of the whole team. Thank you so much. But if you think I've forgotten that I asked you, is there a colloquy to last us the next few years, Wayne? You're mistaken. Is there? There really is. And it is continuous testing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Continuous testing. Oh, I like that. Continuous testing. So this is, let me guess, a missing link, seeing as everything's now continuous, but people forgot your part. Well, it's interesting, you know, no matter They forgot what, it, they always forget your part. They do. I mean, testing is really the last piece of the puzzle. And so what we, see, we have seen is obviously speed, right? Yeah. The need for acceleration in terms of software development and actually the matriculation of those applications into either a cloud or people getting access to it. But once you start hitting speed, you start hitting speed bumps, right? Yeah. And those speed bumps are quality. So today, when we face a organization or you face a, a immense competitive pressure, in which quality is the differentiator on how you're going to attain or retain customers, quality really matters. And now cost of quality, now this is interesting. Cost of quality, everyone thinks that's what it takes to actually spend money to make your application good. That's not the cost of quality. Cost of quality is the cost of failure. Yes, yes. The, cost of, the cost of failure in today's economy is so much higher yes. than it was you in pre- not. You cannot afford not to do it. Now, I know you've known Parasoft for a long, long time, and what it's come down to is the ability to automate and the ability to have consistent deterministic outcomes from tests. So you know where you stand. And that's what we've been doing for years. I mean, yeah. for 26 years, we've been doing that. So it is, it, it, it's more of the same, but actually that's a very good point because people will immediately, it resonates, the continuous. Yeah, that must be us because that's what we've been trying. Yeah. Uh, and how are we testing? Uh, well, um, boss, I'll, 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 I'll tell you later. Yeah. Hang on, I know the answer. So yet again, no, I'm with you. I mean, and, and today, in today's economy, we see a lot of people trying different things. So since speed matters, you get a lot of these situations where people are doing these A-B type testing, where they push a release to the cloud, and they filter their A-list uh, clients to one area, and they filter their B-list or trial clients to another. It's really dangerous today. We just did a survey. 90% of our respondents, out of 2,300 respondents said, once they try a site or once they try an API and it fails on them, they will never go back to it. So what does that say about what's the first impression? First impression matters, quality matters today. So this A and B thing, this is like sifting the ones who maybe aren't strategic customers and just experimenting on them? Experimenting on them, giving them, giving them the task of QA. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Absolutely. So, you know, never mind the 26 years, nothing has really changed in the problem set for you guys is always how do you stop the egregious behavior when it's so ingrained? How do you make people want to test continuously? Well, today, there's no question about it. There is a yes or no. Are you delivering a good product to, the organ to your community and do they accept it? So it is black and white today. You're either doing it or you're not doing it. And this is where it's broken up into a number of different phases. You have to be doing the preventative practices to make sure that development is doing the best job pro possible. So you're not filtering those errors downstream to do more functional testing. And in the functional testing area, this is where we come up with really an ecosystem in order to, for you to run really 
rich functional tests. So concepts like service virtualization, which delivers a simulated test environment anytime, anywhere, or test data management, or our API testing solution, which allows you fully automated endpoint testing is really critical in today's economy. The thing about Wayne Ariola, ladies and gentlemen out there, is there is no one so eloquent about testing on the planet <laughs> Earth. It's just a joy to behold I, the I, excitement I, after all this time. I wasn't birthed this way, by the way. <laughs> it was a 10 it's year. A, it's a mutation. <laughs> but it is quite something. So really, just to end with then, let's work this out. So like you're saying, people, I, I'm familiar with the Parasoft yes. name, but not everyone is familiar with the Parasoft. So they go to Parasoft.com knowing that you are enjoining them to have, you know, good habits, best practices, yes. and to understand that it's not all done and dusted yet mm -hmm. by a long chalk, and there are some poor habits, yes. and you guys can help. Absolutely. So if you haven't necessarily invested in that one last leg of, of the whole software development life cycle, and you want that acceleration associated with your SDLC, come visit Parasoft. We'll give you those ideas. I mean, even if it just starts with an idea, we're happy yeah. to make you get to that point where you can actually appreciate the speed and really attain more clients. What's not to like about attaining more clients? Courtesy of Parasoft and Wayne Ariola, Chief Strategy Officer at that gorgeous company. Please go to Parasoft.com right now, noodle around, and uh, if you are one of these guys who isn't attending to it, you know who you are. <laughs> so close the loop with Wayne. Thank you so much, sir. Thanks, Chairman. And thank you for joining us out there on the World Wide Web.